tents along the bank, light bulbs, and the lingering smell of barbecue can only mean one thing in Natchitoches. Well, we're getting ready for our 88th annual Christmas festival season. We are going to have our turn on the holidays event this Saturday, which is the first time we turn the lights on, shoot the fireworks, set up for the 45 nights of lights for the Christmas festival. The gates open at 10, and the entertainment schedule kicks off at 11. Samantha assures us there will be plenty for the whole family to do. Of course, we have our great festival vendors that are going to be down on the riverbank this weekend with funnel cakes, meat pies, corn dogs, all those great uh, festival foods. But we also have amusement vendors with a rock wall. We have a mechanical wool. We have inflatables for the kids as well as a laser tag arena. We have the Hallelujah Chorus and Ukulele Band from Glenview Baptist Church. We have the Matthew Davidson Band performing. We have Amanda Shaw performing. And we even have a tricentennial birthday bash for kids complete with magicians, stilt walkers, balloon twisters, and a special tricentennial uh, treat for the first 300 kids that show up. The city of Natchitoches has been turning on these lights for 88 years. But this year is special because they're also celebrating their 300th birthday. This is actually our 300th year here in the city of Natchitoches. We're celebrating our tricentennial. So the whole year we've been doing different things to highlight different parts of our culture, our history. And so this festival will be part of our tricentennial festival. If you don't know, it was ranked the top three holiday lighting display behind Disneyland and Rockefeller Center last year. So if you haven't been out, I personally invite you to come out and help us turn on the holidays. Bennett Rowland Jr., ABC 31 News, Natchitoches.